So in this quick tutorial, I'm gonna show you guys a super easy way of revealing a subject. Honestly, take you seconds to do. And when I pull back, then drop your arms. And if you guys are digging these short and easy Final Cut Pro tutorials, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification button so that you get notified every time I release a new one. So it's a fairly easy effect to do. It's a great way to reveal different personalities or subjects in your videos. But before we start, I just want to thank VFXNut.com for sponsoring this video. VFXNut has a ton of plugins and title effects that you can use for any of your projects. A lot of the pop-up titles that you see throughout this video are from VFXNut.com. Most of these are also editable, so you can customize it to fit your projects perfectly. Their library is always expanding and growing, plus their plugins are really cost effective. And make sure to check out their Mega Pack bundles as it'll have different variety of titles and transitions all in one pack. I'll leave a link in the description down below if you guys want to learn more about VFX Nut and what they have to offer. So there are a couple of ways you can do this reveal. The first way is handheld. The effect will look best when shot in 60 or 120 frames per second. Now all you need to do is have the camera pointed at your subject. Change your focus mode to manual and have your subject in focus. Then pull the camera back and point it to the ground. You step on it? Oh. In Final Cut, drag your clip to the project timeline. Click on the Retiming Options tab and select Automatic Speed. This will slow down your clip. Then click on the Retiming Options tab again, but this time select Reverse Clip. Press R on your keyboard to bring up the Range Selection tool. Then select the part of the clip that you want to speed up. Now with the part selected, choose fast two times in the retiming options tab. Color grade and add some sound effects to enhance the effect even more. The second way to do this is by using a gimbal. Have it pointed at your subject with them in focus. Then just pull back, but this time walk back with your gimbal, which should keep your footage pretty stable. In Final Cut, drag your clip to the timeline Change it to slow motion and reverse the clip in the retiming options tab by selecting automatic speed and then reverse clip. Bring up the range selection tool again by pressing R on your keyboard. Now select the part you want to speed up. Then speed up that selected portion by choosing fast in the retiming options tab. Add in some color grading and sound design if you wish. And I'd love to see what you guys come up with. So make sure to leave a link to your work in the comment section down below and I'll make sure to check them out. It's my time in my prime. This the prime time, pretty content. Are you content? No 